Hello there. Uh, this is Mike Rice, and I am uh, here to tell you uh, why Fringe Festival is important to me. It has, for me, it has allowed me to realize a lifelong dream of uh, writing a play and see it uh, performed on stage. Without Fringe Festival, my plays would be uh, existing in a vacuum. Fringe, you know, it has been a great avenue for uh, for Kansas City uh, playwrights to uh, showcase their work and uh, show it to the community. So, thank you, Fringe. Fringe is important to me because it's a way to make connections for artists to connect with other artists, for people to discover our art, and for us as artists to discover other artists' work. It's a lot of fun. Hey everybody, I'm Tim Mooney from the Timothy Mooney Repertory Theater. The Fringe is important to me because producing a show in a city where I don't live is a huge deadlift, trying to develop all the production contacts I might need or to negotiate and pay for a space and technicians and getting publicity out and getting reviewers in. I get to expose my art to a whole new world of people, developing friends and followers along the way. I then have the opportunity to turn around and use all that great exposure to demonstrate the value of what it is that I do to schools, festivals, conferences, and theaters around the country. Thanks for all your support. Hi, I'm Rodney Brazil, and I'm a co-founder of Next Stage, and we are bringing our show Meaningless to Casey French this year, and I am performing in it. And I'm Emily Etherton, and I'm directing Rodney Brazil in Meaningless. <laughs> the Fringe is a great place for that to be produced because these organizations like the Kansas City Fringe Festival, they make it possible for independent producers like us to bring in a smaller show just because we think it's exciting and because we think we want to work on it and we think that audiences in these communities that we're going to will want to see it. Exactly. And... Another thing that I love about Fringe is that it brings so many people in the theater community together. People who you may not know, uh, playwrights that you haven't worked with before, directors you haven't worked with before. And the Fringe Festival really pulls from all of those different groups and groups that you wouldn't have known were even there. And from out of town. And from out of town, yeah. exactly, yeah. like us. <laughs> Very excited to be in Kansas City. Can't wait. The Fringe is important to me because, well, it gives you a chance to do something different and to put something out there that people can see. It's my first time ever doing The Fringe, and I hope you're ready. The Fringe is important to me because theater is a live collaborative art. And as a solo performer, there is no more valued collaborator than the audience. And The Fringe allows me to collaborate with a number of audiences as I develop new work. Fringe is important to me because the audiences at Fringe are up for anything. So I can try whatever I want in front of those audiences and their reactions are going to impact the work that I do for years to come. And the community of performers as well as the accessibility of audience members that you'll find at Fringe is unlike anything you'll find anywhere in the performing arts community. It's awesome.